everyone, it's Nancy with She's Got Yarn. Um, I'm back, um, second time in one night. I uh, was not able to uh, get through the whole, everything that I would like to show you tonight. So I, um, I've got a, a yarn haul and I would like to share it with you. Um, but, well, before I do the yarn haul, I almost forgot. I have something that I've never done before. You guys, look what I made! A bunny rabbit! And it was um, Happy Berry. Uh, she had a YouTube, uh, she has a YouTube channel. I know you guys know her. But um, uh, she had a uh, tutorial and I, uh, it, it was actually pretty easy. It was an itty bitty one that she did. I used a big hook because I wanted it to be, you know, substantially, not huge, but I want to give it to my grandbabies. But my, um, my youngest son said, mom, you got to work on the eyes. <laughs> he doesn't like the eyes and I don't have any eyes. So I had to improvise and I, the nose is an X and the eyes, I don't know, they're yarn, but I guess I'll have to get on Amazon and buy some eyeballs. If anybody has any recommendations of the good ones, um, they say I need to get child safety ones. I um, I tried to, I, I bought some little dollar bunny rabbits from the Dollar General and I cut the eyes out of one of them to see how it would look in here. Oh, it was scary looking. <laughs> I took them out and I destroyed a bunny rabbit, little tiny bunny rabbit. The eyes were too small, so, but anyways, I think this is okay. Um, uh, she or he is supposed to have a flower on his head. I didn't get the flower made, um, but uh, I did this last night. I'm so proud of myself. It's my first amigurumi. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Now, my dogs better not touch it. <laughs> oh, all right. I want to get to my yarn haul. I, uh, I've been doing a little shopping, yeah, here and there. I've got you balancing on a basket. <laughs> um, let's see. I went to Joann's on Friday afternoon. I think it was Friday afternoon with my daughter. I had to bribe her to go yarn shopping with me. I told her I'd buy her lunch. <laughs> Oh, she has no interest in yarn. Maybe one day. But anyways, okay. The first thing I um, that caught my eye at Joann's, and I, you know, I saw the first time I saw this was on um, Bag of Day with Crystal. She got it. It's Sunset Nights by Lion Brand, and the name of it's Bali, and it's a number four. And don't ask me what size hook it takes because I can't read it. It's too, it's not, it's too small. And um, I did go um, to the eye doctor and I have new glasses ordered. It's called Eye Glass Express. It's been, on the 17th is when I ordered them and I, they're still not, they're still not back. But I have contacts in, but I, anyways, I can't wait to get them. I'm excited. But, uh, okay, let's get back to this. It's 3.5 ounces, 100 grams, 273 yards, and it's 90% acrylic and 10% polyester. Is that pretty? Bali is the color. And let's see if you can see the sparkle. It's got sequins in it. But I got, I wanted four, but they only had three. And it was buy three, get one free. So I got a purple because I uh, I have three purples from the last haul. So, um, and then I, um, this is from Joann's. I got an email about this yarn and 
can't remember what I paid, but it I got a good deal. You know, I got a discount. But it's the new Vivid Big Twist. Let me mess with the lighting here. about true right there so let me give you the specs on it it's a hundred percent premium acrylic and big twist vivid it's 300 and let me see if I can see I got new contact prescription I don't know if I can see with these readers wait here's some Think. Yeah. 308 yards, 3.5 ounces, 282 meters, 100 grams. But um, I just thought that was really pretty. You know, I'm buying this baby yarn. I have a grandson, but he's really not a baby. He's a, he's a toddler. But, um, yeah, we need some babies in the household. I can make some baby blankets. Right now I'm doing baby blankets for the March of Dimes. But anyways, I got six skeins because I love this stuff. Um, it's so pretty. Put this back up there. And then, um, let's see. Joann's has these bins, like $3.99, and I have some of the Soft Essential. It's, uh, it's shiny yarn. I love it. Can you see that shine? Oh gosh, I can't see it. It's five bulky. It, it recommends a six and a half millimeter crochet hook, six millimeter um, knitting needles. The color is cocoa. And wasn't somebody, I don't know. I was thinking about some yarn today. Somebody had some cocoa, but it was a different brand, dark cocoa. Oh, it's Karen. I was watching Ginger on uh, on her YouTube channel and um, one of the Karen cakes was dark cocoa but it's this is darker than her cake actually I have one I'll probably show you uh, but anyways this has got how many it's got I already told you it's five ounces 131 yards soft essentials and it's really soft made by Red Heart Made in Turkey. And it's already been eight minutes. Oh my goodness, time flies. I don't know, YouTube has changed something like they're wanting us not to make long videos. I don't know. Um, I'm sure someone will tell me on YouTube. And then Joann's, I had fun in the baby section. I'm hoping I don't have this color somewhere, but Not beautiful, and it's that ice cream yarn, and it's 349 yards, 100% acrylic, 3.5 ounces. It's a number three. Yeah. This is three. But anyways, I got four skeins. And then I went back.
back to Michael's. And we got some more fleck yarn because I gave all mine away. <laughs> this stuff is so soft. Oh, I got, it was buy three, get one free. So I don't know what kind of deal that is, but I had them scan all my coupons. Uh, let's see. Orchid, color number seven, 79 acrylic, 21 polyester, um, five millimeter hook, and crochet needles, 4.5 millimeter, and it is really beautiful. And it's got that, like a sheen tint. I love it. But I got two of those. And then I got two more of these. I think I have one. So I've got three of these. The specs are the same. Fleck yarn. It's got 590 yards. Is that crazy? Wow. And this is like limited time only. I'm sure they got a warehouse somewhere full of it. <laughs> it's a medium number four. Five millimeter hook. Looking for the color. Aqua. I should have memorized that. Aqua. Anyhow. Okay, so let's see what else. And then I bought, I just wanted to show you, um, I bought some of this um, scrubology. I've got white, black, and I've got like a teal somewhere in my yarn room. Um, it's buried, but anyways, um, let me try this. I've been seeing some tutorials, um, TL Yarns, she's got a tutorial, and I've been following her really close here lately because I want to learn Tunisian, and, um, I got Volume 1 in Tunisian, by um, Petra, um, I don't know the last name, first name is Petra, is the designer, and she has three volumes, so I ordered volume two and volume three on Amazon this weekend. Uh, they were like nine dollars a piece, so, because I really want to do that. Um, it just looks interesting, so what I did was, is I did a basic stitch, I started a project in Tunisian. I've never done this before. Now I have a, um, oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. I have, I'm doing a, a new uh, project. It's a blanket, um, I think it's, it is Tunisian. I haven't deciphered the difference between mosaic and Tunisian. So, but anyways. I'll figure it out, but, uh, but anyways, this is, I bought a set of hooks, I bought Denise hooks, kind of invested in some nice hooks, um, um, I, I'm disappointed in the furls, I'm disappointed in, um, their hooks, I know that some people love their hooks, but, you spend that kind of money on a hook, you would think they could label it, like put an imprint in it, like stamp it, what size it is. Um, I don't know. I just, I don't, I can't wrap my head around that. Maybe if somebody knows the details to that, they can kind of enlighten me. Um, I just think they're kind of expensive and, uh, and then I bought, um, can't remember the name of these hooks. I bought these. They're not furls, um, but they're they're not cheap either. But they're not quite as expensive as furl. They don't have a size on them. It's like you gotta be kidding me. So I got the size on them. I I wrote it in permanent ink. Kind of weird. But what was it? Oh, let's get back to <laughs> the whole thing. I was trying to 
Well, the Denise hooks, this is a Denise hook, and I've got a 52 inch cord, because I'm gonna make a blanket. And I don't care if it takes me 10 years. Um, but this is what I've got done so far. I'm so proud of myself. Look. I'm using that mandala and I'm using, um, uh, they were on clearance with the carry cake. Uh, what are they called? It's right here in front of me. If it was a snake, it would have bit me. This stuff. Um, it's a number four and it's called Rosewater Plum. But I've got that in there. And then um, the other cake is, excuse me, the white elephant. That's this. But this is a simple stitch, look. I gotta block it. And um, you know what I'm gonna use to block? Um, I've got a yoga mat, but I saw some bigger yoga mats. What's the difference? Maybe it doesn't have any lines in it, but I'm gonna use that to block this, but look. Isn't that cool? But anyways, I had fun last night doing this. I really enjoyed it. And, um, and you know, I was just studying the stitches and like if I dropped a stitch, kind of paying attention to what to look for. Um, like on the ends, when you, when you do the ends, you have to grab both stitches and then then you cast back on and you do one, the first one, and then you do two, 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 all the way down. And that's when you fill this bad boy up. But um, no, I had fun. It was relaxing and I don't know. It, I would like to learn, like, I know you guys watch Ginger. She has a Tunisian I think it's Tunisian, maybe it's a mosaic, but there's a blanket on the back of her chair where she sits and it's got like all these, I don't know, like Navajo designs. Um, I may not be accurate in that, but you know, you kind of get what I'm talking about. Um, but that's what I want to learn how to do. But I guess you got to start somewhere. But this is so squishy too. But um, yep, yeah, I'm excited. And I got it in my new project bag. I want to show you this project bag. Um, I needed a big one because this is going to be a blanket. But I got these bags at Bell's Outlet. See through. I got two of them. They're beach bags. And I love them. And they come with a smaller bag. And darn it. They're not in here. But they have. Um, it's like, the other bag is like, kind of this size, maybe a little bit bigger, and it has a strap, but, you know, to put projects in, but I like the fact that I can take this with me, like, this summer, when I go on vacation, you bet you I'm taking my yarn with me, but, uh, anyways, Oh, it's 19 minutes. I want to, um, real fast, I want to show you some more, more of my yarn haul. I, um, I'll try to go through it quickly. Went to Michael's. I think I showed you the, this one. This is that, um, dark cocoa. No, I showed you what I got. I bought two more of the dark cocoa. That's right. I bought two more of these. Or no, maybe just one. And then it's Karen cake. Let me give you the specs real quick. Um, it's a number four, five millimeter crochet hook, um, four and a half knitting needles. The color is dark cocoa. 
It has 530 yards, 250 grams, and then it's called Soft Summer Stripes Karen Cotton Angel Cake. But that's kind of like a, almost like a taupe. I don't know, it's a pretty color, very pretty color. And then I got another one, Karen. Um, this colorway is Heather, kind of like a lavender in it. Can you, let's see. kind of true to color. Whoop, there. <laughs> it's not that light. It's kind of a pink color. Alright. My camera's not the best. Alright, and then I don't know why I bought this. I have this already in my shelf. I think it just got put in my cart accidentally. But this is Karen Cotton Cakes. And I have this from last year. I have cotton cakes that I didn't use. I didn't go too crazy because I do have a lot from last year that I did not use up. But I love looking at them. Here, I got another one of that um, Heather. Cotton Ripple. I swear I wouldn't buy this stuff, but I got it. It was $7.99 or buy two, get one three, free or something. I don't know. But anyways, it is Mauve Glow number three. And I cannot read the size hook. I wish they would not make it so tiny. All right, four millimeter hook, four millimeter crochet, I mean, um, knitting needle. There's 491 yards, 240 grams, 8.5 ounces, but look at that color. I think that's pretty. And I, I got it to go, this color's in there ever so slightly, but. My camera this time somebody said they got tired of looking at the top of my head <laughs> you don't realize that you know all right so I got two of these the specs are the same the color is clear view Isn't that pretty so got two of those and I got this to go with it and I got Two of those. I broke down and got them. I'm a sucker. And then, let's see. Yeah, I got two of the blue. Woo, I'm having a hot flash. All right. I got these. I got this to go with that taupe. Um, last week I got one of these, but I went ahead and bought a second one. And then there's the second one that goes with this. But I think that pattern is really pretty. All right, and then last of the cotton cakes. I got, what color is this? Summer Sage, isn't that pretty? I like, I like sage. I know my, my kids tell me it's outdated. My house is like a kind of a green. It's called hardware green, but I love the color. And I, re, I painted my house again the same color. And they're like, why did you paint it the same color? I said, because I like that color. It's my house. But, uh, but yeah, I like that color. 
I have some Hobby Lobby yarn that I got. Let me just make sure. Oh gosh, I have some more. <laughs> I'm never gonna get to all of it. I'm an addict. I'm a yarn addict. I love to shop. Um, I got, oh, see, I bought another one of these. I don't know why I bought these. I already have these. They're the cotton cakes from last year. I guess they're probably a little different, but they got a lot of yardage, but maybe I'll have to use them up this year. Maybe Pamela with a Doreen Crochet will she'll get that Cardi done so I can pattern so I can make it. But, um, okay. This is Hobby Lobby. I love this yarn. The color is Bright Road, and I'm sure you've seen this um, Veronica with uh, oh, can't remember the name of her channel. Chef Steels, Veronica Steel. But um, I love her channel. I just am terrible with names, but 100% acrylic. But this reminds me of her, <laughs> this color. And I got three of them in that color way. Thing. I'm tired of running out of yarn when I'm making something. The specs are the same here. Hobby Lobby, I love this yarn, and it's sand dunes. There, you can kind of see it. Isn't that pretty? I really like that, but it, I got four of them. build another room onto my house. I got one closet I got my eye on and I don't know if my husband's going to let me put stuff in there, but in the house. <laughs> I stole all the closets. Um, it's not for yarn. The closets are for all my clothes. This is ivory. I love this yarn. It's just the cream color. And I got this bag at Bell's also. Tell me, is that not pretty? I love it. But anyways, I thought it was a pretty project bag. And I got two of these with the clear. So I'm all project bagged out. I've got plenty of bags. buy some fur. It was in the clearance rack. I want to show you something I got. I love schemes like this, Premier Serenity. They don't make them big like this anymore. It's so sad. If they, if they do, they're very limited. But um, it's 100% acrylic, number five bulky. And it is 295 yards. You can see the colors in there. All right, and I um, I got suckered Bernay. Your inspirations was it five skeins for 20 bucks? I thought they were like skeins of yarn. A little bitty things. I got suckered into this. I I know better. I know better to pay attention. I know better that I should pay attention. But anyways, there's 200 yards on this one. This isn't too bad. I got five. 
And then, um, but the sparkles, what caught my eye, and the sparkles are tiny. There are 100 yards metallic, acrylic and metallic, 2.8 ounces, 160 yards. But um, I thought it was like a Christmas green. I was thinking of Christmas this year, you know, making some, um, making some of these hats I made last year. Everybody was fighting over them. And, darn it. I'm sorry, you guys. But here's... Um, same ones, the sparkle yarn. I know there's one of them. I was just disappointed in the size. But you know, it would have been nice if they would have been a little bit, I don't know, at least 200. But, yep. And, got distracted. I got that at the Dollar Tree. I don't know if, I just want to say something real quick. I don't know if you guys um, have crickets, but you know the material, the vinyl and stuff, is really expensive. Um, the Dollar Tree is selling that stuff, you know, limited to certain locations, but for a dollar. I saw where they have the clear transfer, they had like four colors of the vinyl and then four colors of, I can't remember what it is. I have a Cricut and I'm still learning. But anyways, I mean, that's a major deal. I mean, a roll is like 10, 15 bucks. Some of them are 20 bucks for a dollar. So if you have a Cricut, go in the crafter's aisle, look for that stuff. It comes in a box. There's a YouTuber that showed me that. Um, I don't know her name. She's new. Okay. And we got purple. It's probably grape. Amethyst. But I got five. And I got, oh. This is like a coral. A coral, good guess. We have five of those. There's that purple. And then I got some white. The, the white regular satin is, is a normal size skein, you know? I got scammed on the size on the glitter one. But you know, you see that glitter, we all go gaga over it. I do anyways. And they got me. I wasn't paying attention. But that's it for my yarn haul. Um, and my um, finished project. And um, I hope everybody had a, a nice Easter. This is my Easter bunny. This is my first amigurumi. I'm so proud of myself. And thank you. Um, it's Happy Berry. It was her pattern. Uh, she had a YouTube um, tutorial. And um, I whipped that together last minute. It's my very first one. And I'm very proud. My son says the eyes are creepy. But anyways, I'll have to buy some eyes. So this is a start. Well, you guys have a great evening. And um, also, I want to thank all my returning subscribers and any new subscribe, any newcomers. You're welcome to subscribe to my channel. I would be, um, it, it would make my day. Um, if you like my content, of course, I'd like for you to subscribe. And that way you would um, hit the bell and that way you would get notified every time I have a video. I'm, my channel is mostly about yarn. Um, what I've made, I share a little bit about my animals. I'm a, a big dog lover and, um, and I, uh, I'm a grandma. I have two small grandchildren. Actually, I have four grandchildren. Two step-grandchildren and then four little ones. Two and four and the, the step-grandkids are 10 and 12 so teenagers scary <laughs> anyways y'all have a great evening love y'all